I've had a lot of Christmases in this house, but the one I most remember was in 1944. My Uncle Jack was home from the war. His ship had crossed the English Channel and landed on Omaha Beach on D-Day. My mother, father, sister, Aunt Betty, Uncle Jack, and I were all together. And I got my first bicycle. Look, I got some sugar in the ration line today. Great, we can make Christmas cookies. I know, and I even have some ration coupons left over. Ah, great. It's good to see you, Jack. We've been listening to reports on, on the wireless about the invasion. It's pretty terrible. Well, I want to thank you for letting Betty live here while I was overseas. Oh, it's our pleasure. She was a great help with the kids and her and Margie planted a swell victory garden. You know what? I got something to show you, Jack. Follow me. All right. So, Jack, as you probably know, with the metal and rubber shortages, it's pretty daggone hard to find new bikes these days. They just aren't making them. But I was able to find a couple of bikes for the kids for Christmas. This is real great, John. Kids are going to love them. On D-Day, I looked in the sky, and all I saw were airplanes. American planes. And I thought to myself, my wife built those planes. I didn't build all of them. In my eyes, you did. Come down and open your presents! <laughs> Merry Christmas! It may have only been a second-hand bicycle, but it was the best Christmas present ever. <laughs>